One of Earth's largest growing environmental problems is pollution. There are many forms of pollution in the Earth, and there are five categories invading our oceanic areas. DDT is the first synthetic insecticide created in the 1940s. People used it for insect control on farms as well as to combat malaria and other insect-borne diseases. DDT is very persistent and hard to break down. Even years later, DDT is still invading our environment. In a typical year, 1.3 million gallons of petroleum are spilled into the U.S. waters. According to the U.S. Department of Energy, these spills are happening from vessels and pipelines. Birds and other marine animals ingest these oils when trying to clean themselves, which ends up poisoning them. Fish and shellfish will not be exposed immediately to these oils, but can come in contact with them when it's mixed into the water column. As we have learned, plastic is photodegradable, so it breaks down in the sun, but doesn't go away. It breaks into small, microscopic pieces, which plankton eat, and the chemicals work their way up the food chain to fish, in a process called bioaccumulation. Fish in the North Pacific consume 12,000 to 24,000 tons of plastic each year, which can cause intestinal injury and death. Today, billions of pounds of plastic make up about 40% of ocean surfaces. There are seven types of plastic. The most toxic plastics are polystyrene, polyvinyl chloride, and a category that we call other. Polystyrene is styrofoam, which is used for disposable dishware like cups, plates, and takeout containers. These are a large form of trash found on streets that wash into our oceans. Polyvinyl chloride, or PVC, is typically thin and malleable. It is used in products like shrink wrap, cellophane, plastic toys, bubble wrap, and most things that are translucent or transparent. The category that we call other is a mix of other type of plastics or their resins. They usually contain BPA, which is a chemical that can damage the endocrine systems of humans and animals. Since 1960, at least 1.1 billion pounds of sewage sludge has been dumped off the SoCal coast. Sewage affects 96% of heavily populated areas and also has a big effect on our coral reefs. Poorly treated or untreated discharge are the main parts of our sewage problem in our ocean. Invasive species. An invasive species can be any kind of living organism that is not native to an ecosystem and causes harm to the environment, the economy, or even human health. Invasive species are primarily spread by human activities, often unintentionally. Higher average temperatures and climate change will also enable some invasive plant species to move into new areas. PCB. PCB is a man-made chemical that are oily liquids and oily solids. They're resistant to extreme temperature and pressure. PCB was manufactured from 1929 until manufacturing was banned in 1979. Population of orcas and dolphins are being affected by our PCB pollution. PCB also has toxicities that affect bird, fish, and mammals of our marine life. If you want to find out how to help our oceans, please visit the following websites.